that congratulate initiates. Judge Maringa reports on a practice which continues to be observed despite warnings from the Ministry of Health. <laughs> At the crack of dawn, these young boys from Miseku village make a long walk headed to the river for mud smearing ahead of facing the cut. These had been preceded by ringing of bells at their uncle's home as a form of official invitation to the ceremony. At home, the circumciser, full of ancestral spirits, keeps hovering around and restless, all these being part of a rite of passage. Elders from the region had assured residents that the practice would not take place this year and health CS Mutahikagwe had also issued a stern warning. And we have said that uh, circumcision can only happen along very strict guidelines discussed and executed with the officers of the Ministry of Health. So those who might go carrying out circumcision with all sorts of gadgets and killing our children will be held completely and totally responsible. We have, because we have already said that this is not something that you should go doing. This spread is, this, this, this virus is very, very easy to spread. Can you imagine if you had a circumciser who is positive himself and goes cutting away a hundred kids, can you imagine the impact of something like that? So I think for those who are sane, because I am, there are guys who are just insane, for those who are sane, please stop your children from being taken to, some, to somebody. While some people want the ceremony postponed to 2022 since it is held in years ending with even numbers and also due to the COVID-19 pandemic, circumcisers have opposed the move vehemently and are already on it. Leo, we are going to go to the hospital. Na mimi wakati imilianza siku hiyo wiki ilikwisha hii sahi nimetairisha watoto miambili arupaina mocha sahi. Any amongst us, any groups who in their desire to fulfill what they want to do, flout these laws, will be going against the good of the country and, 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 and the concerns of public health and preservation of health. The Bukusu circumcision is one of Kenya's most anticipated traditional ceremonies and attracts more than 40,000 tourists, both local and foreign, where generations or age sets are named after every ceremony. George Maringa, KTN News.